Good morning, Spolger Nation. I haven't said that in a minute. 7.25. Today, I'm doing the 10,000 calorie challenge. And I'm doing this because I wanna see if you can out-train a bad diet. I've been seeing a lot of 10,000 calories. Um, I think it's gonna be easy. So today I'm gonna be eating 10,000 calories. Tomorrow I'm gonna be burning 10,000 calories to see how hard it is to out-train a bad diet. So today, we're just gonna eat. It's gonna be glorious. I'm actually excited. People are like saying it's hard. I don't think it will be. Jake's wife did a 6,000 and some calorie challenge without even doing a challenge. Yeah, that wasn't a challenge. That was an average. 6,000 what? 300. How many do you think you could eat? I could probably easily eat 5,000 or more. Okay. We'll send you pictures right, today. Um, you, could, you can watch it on my YouTube channel. It's Steve Cook. Um, I'm gonna put the link in this video. You can just hit subscribe. Oh, I want you to send me all the footage. Like, I need the raw footage. I'll, I'll send you, I'll send you, I'll send you the link. Um, the link will be below and then you can watch it. Should I swipe up? <laughs> swipe up. Swipe right too while you're at it. Or is it swipe left? Oh, okay. <laughs> Bye, baby. <laughs> Bye, baby. You ready to do this? To eat? Yeah. This is going to be easy. I think we could pro probably both do closer to 20,000 calories. Um, maybe we'll do that. But again, the point of this isn't to see if we can do 10,000 calories. It's to see if we can out-train a bad diet. So 10,000 calorie challenge. And then tomorrow, we're gonna see if we can burn over 10,000 calories. All right, we're starting the day out. I'm gonna weigh myself to see then after the 10,000 calories what I weigh. I'm guessing it'll be probably a four to five pound swing between this morning and tonight. Um, really, it's gonna depend on liquid too, how much I work out. Um, I'm guessing I weigh about 218 pounds. Um, that would put me up about two or three pounds on the, on the big program that I've been doing. 219. 219 pounds. I don't know what body fat percentage I am. This video isn't a physique update. It's about eating 10,000 calories. Let's go get some breakfast. Sausage, egg, and cheese croissant. Maple fritter, or apple fritter, sorry. Maple frosted. I will also do a glazed, actually no, I'll do a sour cream. 10,000 calorie challenge is commencing. We have Dunkin' Donuts, sausage, egg, and croissant. It's like an average breakfast for me. And then, let's just be honest. honest. Average breakfast, 2,500 <laughs> calories in the books. 3,200. No, it's not. Mine is. How do you figure? Oh, you're just selling mine? Yeah. <laughs> Bro, you can't be. Yeah, but... I'm very full. I'm very full, <laughs> count me out. In this challenge, in this challenge, liquid doesn't count. Liquid does not count at all, so you can't be smashing beers and sodas and things like that. Um, also, you have to have proof. My fitness pal, you have to do add up the ingredients if you make stuff at home, or you have to obviously eat at a place so you can track macros. Yo, Vanilla Gorilla, he's, he's starting strong. Almost 2,500 calories down, real easy. We might have to stop on the way home, get another burger or something. We're gonna destroy this 10,000 calorie challenge, that's all I know. So this morning's, this morning's breakfast, we are looking at 2,440 calories. And I'm actually not at all full. I could eat some more. Um, 221 grams carbs. 149 grams fat. That's two days worth of fat for me in one breakfast. 
and 59 grams protein. I honestly am not that full. We could go, we might have to go smash some smash burger right now. It's only 9.50, smash burger's not open. But, yeah, I'm not full either. Pretty disappointed in this breakfast. Wanna get another one? All right, because Jake called me a pussy, because <clears throat> that breakfast really wasn't all that much. So we're stopping at a gas station um, to get some more food. Snickers ice cream bars. Four? See how many I can finish before Steve comes out. It's pretty indecisive in there. Oh, I'm gonna burn for Two hundred and ten per servings, and there's four servings, so a little bit over a thousand. Actually, no, that's not true. That's eight hundred and eight forty. All I know is I love the looks of getting buying gelato at nine thirty in the morning. This lady is like, "Oh, pistachio, it's a good flavor." And I'm like, "Do you have spoons?" She's like, "You're eating it now." I'm like, "You got a problem with that?" <laughs> now there is a no liquid rule on this so I can't wait for this to melt in this Arizona heat and then drink it so you're just gonna like munch on this stuff today yeah the plan would be I'm gonna go do some work in front of my computer and just eat this just dropped off Jake I'm about 60% done with this ice cream now so you were planning on eating it in front of the computer but you just kept going I was just gonna eat this as the day went on, but to be honest, it's kind of refreshing. You know, it's 10 in the morning now. It's 88 degrees outside. I feel kind of fun to eat. I haven't eaten like this since I was a senior in high school, four years ago. <laughs> I'm right at 32, 33 in between there. And how you feeling? Like a champ. Really? Yeah. All right. I'm still going strong, man. Yo, meal number dose right now. So, first meal of the day, it was about 30, what was it, about 3,300 calories. Um, that's including the ice cream that I had afterwards. So Jake's probably sitting about 200 calories more than me. Meal number two at Smash Burger. I'm not a huge burger and fry guy. I've never been to Smash Burger. These two, these two here are Smash Burger connoisseurs. So, we're gonna go in there. What are you, how many are you getting? I got a plan. Okay. It's a lot. I got a plan. I just gotta, I, I feel like Jake and I are running sprints, I just gotta keep up. Um, that's the plan. So, I can tell you right now, the inflammation I feel in my body right now from all of that sugar, some people might say, Steve, that's not true. It's definitely it's true. true. I've been super tired um, today, and that's why I think that eating out, trying to out train a bad diet isn't possible because the more you eat, the less you actually feel like working out. There's gonna be that critical mass that you hit that's like, okay, you have enough energy to work out, great. Once you go way past that, all of a sudden your energy starts going down. You crash after that sugar high. So I'm already thinking that I'm not gonna be able to out train a bad diet and tomorrow we will also see how hard it is to freaking burn 10,000 calories. Let's go eat. I've never spent in my life $30 at a fast food place. $30. We got, we're adding up the calories over here too. So we got the big patty, extra big patty, gluten-free bun, habanero cheese, extra bacon, fried egg, sweet potato fries, and just times up by two. You got two of those? Two of those, bro. <laughs> we're gonna come in probably around 4,000 calories for this meal, I'm guessing. Okay. So this one's gonna test me, I can already tell.
this is getting hard for me to do. 4,000 calories. I don't even know what, you know, like Big Joe's burger challenges and stuff. I don't know what those are. It can't be much more than this. Each burger, 18,011 calories. Plus the sauce. And we finished. We finished two of them. 1,800. The sauce. The you got the meat. You got the meat. I got meat sweats right now. Yeah, 18,000 calories. Oh, 18,000 calories. 1,800. My arteries are clogged in my brain and I can't think. <laughs> Done and done. We're gonna take that little piece to go. How you feeling, Jake? Feel good. Good? No, you don't. I'm full, full, but I'm full, but I feel good. I'm so full. <laughs> I'll use another nap. It's putting me into a nap coma after every meal. I'm gonna move. I haven't been this full since I got done shooting with Muscle Fitness. And I walked around the streets of Venice Beach, and I just went to every restaurant and ate something for like four hours. I legitimately tried to make myself throw up. Some people aren't gonna like that, but I'm sharing everything with you. I'm at a moment, I'm at a moment of really being insecure right now. Are you left? Yes, he is not left right now. What are you talking about? <laughs> if I poke in the stomach, will you go? Woohoo! <laughs> oh, yeah. There it is. Let's go left. Good? Oh, I'm counting this five calories. No, I'm not. That was miserable. I haven't been that full, I think, since like doing stupid shit in high school. All I know, we got like 2,200 calories left. We did nearly, real close to 8,000 calories in two meals. It's so uncomfortable. I thought, oh, it, I mean, it's gonna be easy, two meals. We started at 9.30 this morning. If we would have started at like 6 a.m., it would have been a lot easier. It's 3.05. 10,000 calories isn't hard. But eating back to back for, you know, 3,500, one of 3,300, the other one of whatever, 40, 4,500, 4,400. That was the hard part. That was miserable right there. Um, if I could tell you guys one tip on this, I would say, hey, don't do it. It's not necessary. I'm doing it purely for science. I want to see how hard it is to burn 10,000 calories compared to eating 10,000 calories. But if you do decide to do a 10,000 calorie challenge, start early in the morning. That way you don't have to eat 4,500 calories at one sitting. Ugh. Uh, we try to get an arm workout. Honestly, I feel like all I have, I have so much inflammation in my joints from the sugar, like my whole body aches. I was trying to do, I was, I was doing arms tonight, the new arm blaster. And I'm not gonna lie, I was just, it, I was full. I was just not into it, achy, achy, achy joints. Good news here, babe. Oh, look at how cute my girlfriend is right now. Thanks, Bill. I came to save Does that him. make you happy when I say yeah, that? That's so cute. I'm so I, I'm stinky. I'm probably oh, you, you actually worked up a good sweat, huh? No, what, what's been happening is legit. I just have, I've been sweating all day. <laughs> no, like when you eat a whole lot, you just sweat all the time. I'm like, I've been hot all day. Um, so See, this is the last meal the though. What's the purpose of this challenge? Okay, the purpose, I'm glad you asked because there's gonna be a lot of people. The curious. purpose is to see if you can out-train a bad diet. So we're, we're showing how, you know, fairly easy. Like it hasn't been that hard. Meal two was hard. We, we're doing this in three meals. 
three meals. That's crazy. That's macro. Yeah. So like that's over 3,300 calories a meal on average. Meal two, we did 4,300 calories. That meal, that one hit me. That one hit me hard. So now, babe got us. I got them brownie cookie sandwiches that are vegan and nut free. But guess what? One sandwich is 340 calories. That's pretty good. I got them wheat and gluten free cookies. Leave it to babe. Like we haven't been doing healthy all day. And Corey's like, we got these organic <laughs> coconut cookies. <laughs> And them. then we have this pizza. I have these dairy free chocolate chip cookies over here from this place. And then we have the barbecue. Oh, oh this yeah. Is, this is Steve's. This is the kale one, and that's the barbecue. From Chicken. Modern Market. The from Modern Market. No, the, this one's 1,000. This is about 800. I have legitimately about 20, 2,400 calories. Well, roughly 2,400 calories. So I have to eat that whole pizza. I have to eat. One of those. Two of those. No, you don't need two because we have the whole thing of ice cream in there for you, baby. <sighs> Salted caramel waffle. Oh, baby. How far along are you? Dang, you still got the shreds though. Because I wouldn't. I'd look like. Pardon my girlfriend. What? You do. You're so cute. Okay. Okay, let's, let's do it. Eating. Let's do it. And he said, oh my god, oh, yeah. Same yeah. time. Yeah, these are so good. Stop! I'm sorry. Stop! <laughs> We are finishing up the pizzas now. Each one of these cookies is 340 calories, right? Yeah, they're big. 760 down out of my 200 and, or 2,000, what is it, 2,400, 2,400? <laughs> Did you hear that? Oh, yeah. This one is crispy, no, 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 it's chocolate, salted caramel. Oh, I don't know that. And then this is just one. Mine's over now. Most people have what is called palate fatigue. You get tired of eating the same thing over and over again. I'm hitting that right now. I had palate fatigue on the pizza. I'm a whole new man in this <laughs> tub of ice cream right now. Are you? Mm-hmm. I'm good to go. <laughs> Pizza, the, the pizza was 760, ice cream, 1,050, four cookies, four of these snickerdoodle cookies, which are 200 and 260. Shit. What? Jake's already over. <laughs> 10,700. <laughs> oh my gosh! <laughs> 10,700? <laughs> Wow. You know, I'm going to too hard on the cookies. <laughs> <laughs> hey, all I know is that we did this in 12 hours with only three meals. If we would have started earlier in the morning, we still have plenty of time tonight. And eating like five meals, we could easily have 1,500. Jake, <laughs>
nice and sweet. Mm -hmm. Sorry, I should have had something heavy. You're gonna puke. You're gonna puke. You're a little baby. <laughs> <laughs> Is well, he allowed to puke? No, I'm not. I can't puke. puke. I don't puke. She was so concerned. <laughs> Her face. It looks like something's brewing. She should have been lunch. You <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>